Hi guys, how you going? Welcome to another episode. This episode we're going to talk about fueling and fuel stops for Fink. So there's a lot of questions which come around of what size tank should I run or what fuel stop strategy should I do. So the, there's a couple of options we've got. So the first one is the club fuel, which is provided by the Fink Desert Race Club. So for the four strokes, it's $250 uh, and they give you fuel at three fuel stops and the Fink end. Um, you don't take jerry cans, you don't worry about anything. For the two stroke option, it's $60. You've got to provide your own jerry cans with your own premix and have your own fuel down at Fink. So those fuel stops are very quite common uh, and they're really good for the average guy. For one, you, your stops are about every 60 to 70 kilometers. So you break the race up into four parts. Uh, you get that 30 seconds to a minute rest, which really helps the average guy, um, and it's hassle free. Or the other option is to organize your own fuel stops. Now most people choose the two stops, one at the 80 mark and one at the 130 to 140 mark. Uh, this breaks the race down into three segments, two fuel stops. Uh, the problem is here, there's a lot of logistics involved. So because the racetrack service road closes early in the morning, your team needs to be down there very early on race day one. Um, you would need two support crews to be at each fuel stop and then you need fuel at the think end as well. Um, one of the benefits of this for the really fast guys is they can get their fuel stop times down um, but for the average guy to me it's more hassle than it's worth. Um, so the pros, like they're doing two stops, most of the time they're fueled up and gone within 15 to 20 seconds. Um, for the average guy I think a bit of a rest and you'll end up saving that time further down the track. So if you are going to go with the club fuel, um, you only need about a 70k fuel range, so you don't need to go these massive tanks. If you are going to choose to go to the, the two stop strategy, um, that's where you'll probably upgrade to getting a bigger tank. Um, most of the guys hover around that 10 to 11 litre mark um, and that'll get them. Obviously the faster you go or the, the harder you're riding the bike, the more fuel you're going to chew. Um, so something else to work out in pre-running, but for the average guy, do the club fuel, it's hassle free, and you're set up for the day. Cheers.